recently Kardashian's troubled ex Scott Disick has been in the midst of downward spiral for months, but he appears to have hit rock's bottom. Multiple outlets are reporting that the reality star and father of three was recently hospitalized and placed under a 5,150 psychiatric hold. The news comes after months of reports of Disick drinking heavily and traveling the globe in what insiders have described as a non-stop party. It's unclear what sort of behavior prompted authorities to rule that Disick was a danger to himself or others, but he was reportedly taken into custody late on the night of August 18. On August 18 Laft responded to a call from the home of Scott Disick, the Los Angeles Fire Department tells us weekly of the incident. Lost Hills sheriffs were also on the scene shortly thereafter. Laft officials transported Mr. Disick to a local hospital. No other information will be given out at this time. Us reports that despite their messy breakup, Ptney visited the hospital several times to show her support for Scott. Sources say Ptney is deeply concerned about Disick, who has been in rehab four times since 2015. His latest bender is believed to have began after Scott learned that Ptney is in a serious relationship with Jan's Bend Jimmer. The 23-year-old male model is not just dating Ktney, but has reportedly assumed the father fig role in the lives of Scott's children. Disick is now out of the hospital following the aforementioned incident, but it seems his erratic behavior shows no signs of abating. Several insiders are claiming that Scott is ignoring his friends and family's pleas that he enter rehab to get the treatment he needs. Adding to concerns is the fact that Disick has unexpectedly moved out of the Hidden Hills home he purchased to be closer to his children. He recently placed the property up for sale or rent. Scott is absolutely losing his mind, and that is why he has moved out of the Hidden Hills house, a source close to the situation tells Radar Online. He does not want his kids around Yuns, and he does not want Yuns to try and be a father figure at all. There's currently no word on where Scott is living, or whether or not he's still drinking after his release from the 5150. Sources close to the Kardashians say the family had hoped to keep news of the 34-year-old's hospitalization under wraps. The last time, Disick was hospitalized is when he nearly died of alcohol poisoning while partying in the Hamptons in 2014. Our thoughts go out to Disick and his family during this difficult time, and we hope that Scott is able to find the help that he needs. We'll have further updates on this increasingly alarming situation as more information becomes available.